Good morning, everybody. I hope everyone is well today, but if not, we're going to pray for you just a moment. Yesterday, it rained a lot, and today, what do we have? We have puddles. I don't know if you can see that there, but you can see the water. You can see the reflection of that tree in the water, but we have puddles now. Now, puddles can do a couple different things. Puddles can be uh, a problem if there's too much water uh, but puddles also can soak back into the ground puddles rain puddles can clean things up they can definitely make changes so my thoughts and ponderings this morning are what comes after this storm that we've all been going through what kind of puddles are going to be left behind and what will be their effect so i want to pray about what comes next today and also pray for what's happening right now and the decisions people are making as far as how to get to whatever comes next so let's just pray heavenly father thank you lord for waking us up this morning thank you lord for the rain that comes and causes change and thank you lord for uh what comes after a good rain lord we know that not everything is good about the storm that has come through and i look around here also there's not just nice friendly puddles but there's a lot of limbs down and things like that that um, are a little bit more on the destructive side and we know that this thing that's happening right now is on the destructive side so i pray for those who right now are going through that destruction that they're uh, their jobs have uh, stopped for at least a time or their family members are sick or they have so many other concerns and anxiety and wondering what's going to happen. So I pray, Lord, that you would release the anxiety that people are under and that you will help them. And I pray, Lord, that you would guide us towards whatever it is that comes next. I pray for wisdom for our leaders that are trying to figure out what order to open things up. I pray for our president, for our congressmen, for our senators, for our state and local governments. Lord, you know who it is that is making each one of these calls. I pray for wisdom on the part of those who are analyzing data, that you would help them to see what they need to see. I pray, Lord, that you would get us ready for whatever it is that comes next. I pray that you would uh, work things out so that some of the aftermath can be good, so that some of the things that happen can result in positive change. And I pray that you would help us to be refreshed and nourished from the good parts of it even though it feels like there aren't a whole lot of good parts but i pray that you would help us to hold on to the things that are good and positive and i pray that you would help everyone to recover from the things that have been negatives i pray for a specific um, a couple of people who specifically asked for prayer for their moms you know who those moms are and what the needs are today i thank you that today is decision day for the seniors and that I'm seeing post after post of where they're going to college. I pray that you bless them in their schools, help them with every decision that they need to make regarding that and that you would uh, just help them to rest in the fact that they've made decisions and that you would encourage them in their new places that they're going to be next year. I pray that you would help, uh, help us today to have a fantastic day that we would find some kind of encouragement for somebody. And we just thank you and praise you in Jesus' name, amen.